how much does a robot cost? For manufacturing professionals seeking to procure flexible automation for tasks such as automated assembly, deburring, or welding, it can be difficult to find information about how much you can expect to spend. Starting at a price point of $20,000, we took a walk through the Yaskawa booth with Zane Michael, Director of Business Development for Welding, to answer the question, how much robot can you get for 20 k And what can you expect to spend to get the job done? If you search the web and you're looking for a, a $25,000 robot, more than likely it's going to be used. Um, and it's not going to be completely integrated. So I, I don't see that threshold being uh, you know, the, the entry into the market. Yeah, you can get a robot, uh, a mini here, for less than $20,000 in a box. Okay, but that's it. No grippers, no custom engineering, no uh, safety, right? So customers today are looking for a complete solution, integrated, everything, grippers, weld package, con you know, conveyance. So as you can see here, we're just doing a little assembly of a circuit to show some of the flexibility. This is a full six axis arm, okay, half a kilogram, and has a reach of a little over 300 millimeters. So anything you can put in that uh, zone uh, and keep the payload less than a half kilogram uh, would be a great application. Obviously not welding, but some kind of little pick and place, moving parts around. Where customers might make a dedicated two or three axis machine, this would give you a lot more flexibility because you have full six axes. Yeah, so you scout our GP series, starting at seven, the GP8, what you see here is a full six axis robot. You can get the robot on a skid for the mid to upper 20s, but Right, you, you, need, you need integration, as we've been talking about. And here, this robot, high speed, it has a horizontal reach of almost 800 millimeters, uh, very fast. And we have customers that have been in the robotic market a long time, and they've developed internal capabilities, you know, to design great robotic tooling, that they'll buy a prepackaged solution and, and integrate that. But most customers, to do a full cell integration, they don't understand the safety standard, everything that you know they need to be aware of and need to rely upon Yaskawa. So a robot out of the box, you can order it and get it in a week, okay? A fully integrated cell where, the, where the, we're gonna run it off, we're gonna train uh, the end user, we're gonna install it, you're looking at 20 to 30 weeks. So this is an ArcWorld 1200. Yaskawa was the first to market to bring a prepackaged, pre-engineered solution to the market in 1990. Today we have over 20 different models available in our arc welding solutions. So here we've got two robots. We've got a servo positioner. The customer puts their fixtures on side A and B, adds power, program, and they're ready to go. We have a whole factory that spits out these. Uh, we do hundreds of these a month, arc worlds. Different flavors, different styles, different positioners. This is a big part of our business, these standard pre-engineered modules, which reduces the cost, reduces delivery time, and takes out the custom integration that may be needed. If you set it, it's one skid, set it on the floor, again, power, add power to it, uh, add uh, the welding wire and gas, add your tooling and parts, program it, you're in production. We have a huge voice of the customer program, and our customers telling us, hey, I like, I like certain options, and I'm gonna show you one right back here. I don't know if the camera's got it. This is a, uh, so in the welding process, I need to, I need to change the contact tip. So if the customer knows the tip needs to be changed, um, the operator could come around, request a tip change. When the robot is done with the cycle that it's in, it's going to put the welding torch in here. I can open this box, change the tip without taking the robots out of production. So I could come in right now, take the nozzle off, and pull the tip out, change it. Um, complete, um, lock it back up, tip change complete, robot goes back in production. This cell here uh, you can have on your floor depending upon the welding power supply options for a 160. Um, it, it also comes available with one robot that would be around 100. Yeah, here, the, the basic robot, it has the welding power source on it. I've got a I've got a, uh, a vision, a laser finder telling me where the weld joints are at. I've got a servo positioner, all the safeguarding that meets the ANSI RIA specs, right? So all of that adds up that, again, our customers, 
that don't, don't have the ability to do that want to buy a complete solution.